Okay, so we are back I'm trying to fix this 1999 Nissan Pathfinder. I showed the, the symptoms of this uh, bad camshaft position sensor in a previous video. And what I'll be doing in this video is showing you guys how to diagnose a bad camshaft position sensor, which is part of my distributor on this vehicle, with a digital oscilloscope or uh, the Pico LabScope software. And these are the connections that I have made. If you zoom up on the two connectors here, you can see I'm connected to the six pin connector, terminals three and four. Those are my two signals up here, so you can see it from up here. Possibly, there you go. You get the idea. The terminals three and four. And those are my two Hall Effect sensor signals. And I'm going to go ahead and start this vehicle. two graphs that show the two signals that we are getting. This is one of my sensors, and we are getting a nice, consistent, square wave pattern. Uh, I'm going to have to change the time frame on this other scale so that you can see what the second bad uh, signal looks like. Uh, I don't know if you can hear the misfire and correlate that with what's, what's happening on the graph, but every time the engine cuts out and dies, we have, we can see our signal on the top cutting out. It's not even, it's not consistent. And in the occasion that this vehicle stalls completely and will not start, this sensor on the bottom will maintain its steady waveform during cranking, and this will flatline. That's all for now. I'm going to go ahead and replace the distributor and camshaft position sensor assembly. I'll make a second video as a follow-up. Thanks.